Hello everyone. Welcome back to Btronx channel. Today, let's see a demo on how to extract a specific substring from a larger string. We will be using ChatGPT. Okay, imagine we have a, a scenario like there is a big string. Okay, and we need to take only a portion of a data from that big string. Okay, this terminology is called as slicing. Some people they'll say snipping, segmenting, clipping, but one and all, these are all the same. Okay. If you look into here, you can see, okay, that all the data are clustered. So we need to pick only a portion. Okay, we need to take only a date or only we need to take only correspondence. So how we can get it in Excel? Okay, we will be using chat GPT. Okay. If you are someone using Excel in your day to day job, let me tell you something. You are going to be replaced unless you are integrating AI in your Excel. If you integrate AI in your Excel workflow, let me tell you something. You are going to be 10x more productive and you, you will be getting that promotion that you deserve. If you want to learn all this, join me for my two hours workshop on Excel using AI. So this is our Excel sheet. Okay. And this is the keyword. Okay. So imagine this, imagine this is like a, uh, some so SSN number or some credit card number just for your guess okay and you want to take only the xay okay the last four digits okay so for that we need to get the length okay so we will do step by step okay we will be using chat gpt we will prompt the chat gpt how it is giving us okay so here is the chat gpt okay let me use Excel to extract specific substring from a larger string. Okay. Let's see what are the functions this chat GPT is giving. Okay, so extract a specific substring from a largest substring in Excel. You can use a combination of functions like left, right, mid, find, len. Okay, so len is for length. Okay, so we will be using, like we'll use mid, okay, as you all aware of left, right, we'll be using mid. So to extract a substring starting, this is the formula, okay, we should give mid. And we should give the text. What is the text? Here we can give the uh, cell number. Okay. And what is the starting position and number of characters? Okay. So they have given the example also. Hello world. In the uh, if we want to return only world, okay. So we should give one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it starts from seven. And from here, one, two, three, four, five. This is the world. Okay. So it will return. So the same thing we will use over here. Okay. We will use the same operation. Okay. There are various things, but uh, we will go into this. Okay. You can use left, you can use right and mid find. Okay. Today for our learning, we'll use mid. Okay. So I'll be going here. Okay. So for length also, we can go. Okay. If we, if we go to this part, there is a length, right? is equal to if i give over all the places so 16 18 16 this is for understanding purpose okay so before we enter into the actual part an important update okay as you all aware that ai is taking over the world in such a short span of time we have seen so many layoffs millions of jobs replaced by ai and you don't want to get affected by this recession wave so AI won't replace you, but the person using AI will replace your job. So if you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our three hours AI workshop in which we will teach you about the best AI tools to upskill, increase your productivity and enhance your career. All the installation steps and other AI tools will be explained detail in our B10X program. So make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description. Okay, guys. So if you go to this, our this is our site. Okay. So you can beat an extra team. Okay. And go over here. You can see all the upcoming workshop. For example, office using a workshop. Register now. It will take you to this page. Okay. The next 
workshop will be on December 3rd and the instructors and why to join this course and like what you will learn from this workshops. So all these details will be there. So don't miss to join the workshop. Now let's go to our part. Okay. So as the formula aware actually like mid and I'm giving this equal to this we have got the thing. Now I'll put mid function. Okay. So equal to mid. Okay. So a1, a2, right? It is a2, comma. What is the part we need? We need the last part, right? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay. 13, comma. I need to from, from that 13, 5, 4, right? Comma, 4. Okay, so we got the x81. Similarly, now it is 18, right? If I drag over here, we may not get the last, we'll see. Yes, only UI has come. Okay, because we it picked from the 13 and it has given the 4, whereas the length is 18. Okay, so this may not work. So for that, we need to uh, take, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. So we need to give 14 and it is, will be 5, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, so we got it. Okay, so, so same way we need to do for here. Okay, it will be 1, 2, we'll give the same. It may not be the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Come on, four. Okay. It should be thirteen. No, it'll be thirteen. Come off. This will be correct. Or T Y. It may be thirteen. RTOA. Here we need to give maybe 14, right? 14 comma 5. Okay. So similarly here it will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. One, well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, we got it. So here it is 18, right? So we need to take from Amberson, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Fourteen comma one two three four five. Okay, so we got it. So this is the way, guys. Okay, because uh, for example, uh, why you may ask where this is applicable? For example, any Flipkart or Amazon or any other e-commerce uh, website, you are downloading the data. Okay, the data may not be exactly in the Excel sheets. Okay, if you look into old uh, e-commerce sites, they may have in .dot file or in a .dot txt file. So how in the txt file, it will be like this, okay? All the things will be congested, okay? So you may need to take from the Excel, you may need to convert it to Excel and then or without conversion also, you may need to use slicing. At that time, this may help, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the session. Take care, bye-bye.